Hi there guys, welcome back to the channel. Thanks very much for joining us again today. I've got a very short video demonstration for you that will show you how to site map a Squarespace website. So um, how to access or create a site map for your site, whether it's for indexing on a search engine or whatever you need it for, um, to kind of create a list of the URLs from your website that are included on there. Just before I do so, um, I'd like to point your attention at a link in the description for this video that will take you through to a personal copy of a free trial version of Squarespace. Okay, so if you want to try all of this out, then you can do so by clicking that, clicking that link in the description. So what you'll need to do is access the domain of your Squarespace site. Okay, so obviously if you open the um, website backend and if you go to the settings tab, you can kind of click domains there and see a little bit of a breakdown on what your domain is, but it's basically the site address that your website is accessed from. Okay, I'm going to presume that you know how to access that. And then if you go and open a new tab and paste that domain name in there, all you need to do is after the dot com, and this works for a private domain that's owned via Squarespace website as well. Okay, so if you've bought a custom domain, then this works exactly the same after the dot com or whatever you've got a dot for, um, put a slash and then type in the word sitemap and then dot XML. Okay, so that's only all you need to add to the end of the URL for your website. And then if I hit enter, there I get a list of all the URLs then from my site. Okay, so you can either copy paste that, or if you need to give something like the Google search engine, your sitemap link, that's it. Okay, so you, you'd copy and paste your URL, plus then a forward slash sitemap.xml. Okay, and that's, that's it. And that concludes our video tutorial. So like I mentioned, if you want to try Squarespace out for yourself, you've got a free trial version as a link in the description for this video. If you like that kind of content and you want to see more, you can subscribe to the channel and give this video a like. And if you've got any questions or queries or anything like that, suggestions for future videos, you can leave that as a comment down below too. Thank you very much.